So what we're going to do first is register our new block. Now we could do this in set theme or in set a plugin. And in this case, we're going to do it inside a plugin because it, it sort of makes more sense. Uh, I don't want to be messing around with, with the default theme. So I should go ahead and create a channel theme and then create. So for the sake of time, we're just going to create a brand new plugin and we're going to register the block as part of the plugin. So I'm going to find my local installation created by local by flywheel that we did on our previous video the first video of the series and inside my installation I can go to slash app slash public slash WP content and then I'm gonna find the plugins folder so I'm gonna create a new folder for my new plugin I'm gonna call it let's call it hello world block and I open that folder on my code editor I'm going to create a new file, which is going to be the entry point of, of my plugin. And let's call it index.php. And here we're going to write the basic plugin code, which is a comment with a plugin name. I'm going to say hello world block. Find URI, we're not going to have description. Author We're gonna save it and now I'm gonna go to plugins and see if the new plugin is there. So here it is. I'm gonna activate it and now we have our plugin activated. So the next step is gonna be creating the block.